What's good? What's good, everybody? Hey, look, man, uh, man, I woke up this morning, man. Obviously, I woke up this morning because I'm talking to y'all. <laughs> you know, thank God for that. But I woke up this morning, man, and I was just in uh, a real bad mood, man. I had this real bad vibe on me, man. I had this real bad energy about me, man. And, and I don't even know where it came from because, like, the night before, you know, I didn't get into no arguments. I know fights, you know, me and the wife didn't do nothing. We went to sleep just fine, you know what I'm saying? I knew what I had to do this morning. I knew the agenda that I had for today, and I just woke up, man, and I was just, like, in a real bad, like, mood, like a funk for no reason. You know, I'm up. You know, I'm up. I'm breathing, you know, and I'm, and, and I just don't know. It was just something that was just settling on me, man. It was just like, I, I, I wasn't feeling it. You know what I'm saying? And so I recognized it. And I had to make a choice. I had to make a choice to let that, you know, you know, uh, set the path for my day, set the trajectory for my day, or I had a, or I had a choice to change that. You know what I'm saying? And I made a choice, you know, to look myself in the mirror and be like, Nah, man, this, this not, this not, this not what it's gonna be. This not what it is. You know, and um, so that little funky mood that I had, man, I had to get that up off me. You know, and uh, I mean, I, I just kind of want to let everybody know, man, like, because at, at one moment I wanted to be like, man, oh, you know, that just says just who I am, man. You know, I have days like that, but I couldn't accept that. I couldn't accept that because that's not who I am. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't wake up like that. You know what I'm saying? That That's just not me, you know. Uh, just wake up with like an evil spirit Like an evil mood on me or something like that Nah, that's not who I am And what I want to tell people, man We have to get out of that uh, That mindset Of just accepting sometimes Oh, that, that that's just who we is I'm having a bad day Because that's not you You know what I'm saying No one, No one was born with that type of mindset You know what I'm saying Like nobody was born with that type of mindset to where you just wake up on the morning and you just have an evil mood. You see what I'm saying? When when, when you was a child in labor and delivery, nobody looked into that, that, that room when you was just born and was like, man, look at that child. That child already got evil thoughts. No. Through life, that happened to you. You may be indoctrinated that type of thinking. You may have went through some things that, that, that planted seeds in you that make you carry a type of mood like that to make and navigate your life choices Your life choices Which means Life is choice driven Like I always tell people So When you are encountering a funk Or when you are encountering a mood I want y'all to remember two things That mood Whether it's good or bad Could be a fresher breath of air And the mood that can change your life For the better or your mood can be your doom. You know what I'm saying? Your mood can be your doom. Your mood can be your final mood. Your mood can be the worst, can lead you to the worst decision that you can ever make in your life. And that's it for you. Based off of mood. Because at the end of the day, let's be honest. When we want to do things good or bad, we get into a mood. We become in a mood to do something. I'm in a mood to do this. I'm in the mood to do that, even though we maybe don't verbally, you know, um, say I'm in the mood to do this. I'm in the mood to do that. But you get in a mood of some sort to go do what you do. Now, remember, that mood can be a breath of fresh air and the best decision of your life. Or that mood can be your doom. That mood could be it for you. You know what I'm saying? So you have the power to shift that mood. You have a power to, sh to to change, you know, the path of your day. Because a bad funk or a bad mood that you are allowed to settle in on you can last one day, three days, a week, two weeks, three weeks. It, it, a lot of people... You know, uh, a lot of people will, a lot of people will get into uh, this thing of of saying, you know, like they don't get very, you know, they don't get attached to things really easy, you know. And and I get it, you know. A lot of people, uh, 
a lot of people work different. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's kind of like a, an addiction. Some people can break addictions fairly easy. And some people can't. But see, that's why you can't dance around with being in a bad mood or a bad funk. Because you may be one of those persons who easily can't shake things. You know? So you need to recognize it. As soon as you recognize it, you need to get it up off of you. You know, you need to get that bad, you need to get that bad aura up off you. You need to get away from that. You need to get it off your spirit. You know what I'm saying? Because some of those things, sometimes, man, that, that latch on to people and, and, and they can't shake it. You know, so just, you know, recognize it and make the decision to get it up off you. It's simple as that. You know what I'm saying? Like sometimes you wake up and you just honestly don't know. Cause you didn't go to you didn't go to sleep the night before in a bad spirit or in a bad mood. You didn't go to sleep and then all of a sudden you just wake up and then you just feel some type of way. You know what I'm saying? And you need to get that up off of you, man. Because that's going to that's going to cause you, especially if it's bad. You know, if it's great, if it's good, you feeling good, you feeling like you can conquer the world today, man, that's good. Let that be contagious. Let that rub off on people. You know what I'm saying? Like, let let that greatness that you feel, that encouragement that you feel, let that, you know, share that with the world. But on the other hand, <laughs> if it's that bad mood, now, you, you don't, you don't want to be walking around, you know, causing, starting friction with everybody, letting that rub off on everybody because, yeah, that, that ain't the contagious that we want. <laughs> we got enough negativity in the world as it is right now. So, to end on this video, man, just recognize it. Be strong enough to change it. You know what I'm saying? Be strong enough to change it. And uh, get yourself out of that phone. Get yourself out of that bad mood because that bad mood can be your final mood. It can be your doom. And that's it.